deep within the lush landscapes of St. Thomas, there is a plantation, a hidden relic veiled from common view, shrouded in mystery. Its story whispers through time, waiting to be unraveled. Today we embark on a journey to uncover the secrets of the Albion Sugar Plantation, a place obscured from our sight, but not from history's grasp. Get ready as we step into the shadows of the unknown. Yeah guys, so today we're there, Albion, St. Thomas. Yeah man, yeah man, yeah man, yeah man, yeah man, yeah man, yeah man. So, we do the video from yesterday, you know, guys, and... Show the people. We would have some problems, so we reached late and we have to camp out up at Godfrey and all of that and get up and... So now, we get this done. As you know, we are going to document the historical Albion plantation sugar house. Are the sugar crushes in the house, no? See, see, yeah. See, yeah, and, man, and all the things used to go on over there, Alex. Man. I hear you know, say, I hear you teacher, I don't want. But watch, you know, me and the teacher, people are, are God free, you know, call me and say, you know, say, the road cut and like some place cut down, and me and say, what, well, slavery building over one place, and me and say, yeah. He told me back then, but I never really take it serious. True, though. man, true. But then, he called me and he sent me a video clip. I showed him the video clip. He sent me a video clip and I showed me it. And I said, yeah, I have to reach St. Thomas and come get this done. And then I promised you all a hiking vlog. So, the hiking vlog I will do today, I'll do a little hiking. But the hiking vlog that we want to do is the Kunu Kunu Pass in St. Thomas. That's now I'm going to go into details and research it. But anyway, let's do it. Yeah, brother, see the place there over there, sir. You see that? Yeah, that are some of the building them. And if you notice, one day behind the building there, there sir. A big one there where you look upon, one day behind it. And one day right here, sir. I'm on my own, broken the lawn. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town. We're searching for the lost and found. Yeah. But you don't care. You're yeah. on the way. Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air like a blazing flare Among the earliest owners of Albion Plantation were John Nixon, who died in 1774. He also owned the Molletal Estate in St. Thomas in the East. Albion was then purchased by the merchant Robert Ebert, who ran it from 1750 to 1835. After slavery was abolished in the British Empire by the Slavery Abolition Act of 1833, Ebert's executors received compensation in 1835 of £8,291 sterling in respect of 451 enslaved persons at Albion. In 1794, Albion was surveyed by Archibald Edgar, who recorded that it was of 1,492 acres with 294 in cane. It was producing 300 oxides of sugar and 182 punchants of rum. At the time of emancipation in 1833, this had risen to 400 of sugar and 240 of rum, following the enlargement following the enlargement of the plantation through the addition of Spring Garden Plantation in the north and the Kobe Pen in the south. When it was surveyed again by Edward Magritte in 1842, it covered 4,074 acres, but production had fallen to 182 of sugar and 106 of rum. But that place here where we are going, I tell you, I'm curious. But we are going to reach over there, Godfrey. I think that myself. Yeah. I think that myself, bro. Yeah. Nice, you know. You have more chance, more than me, you know. Oh, man? Yeah, man. 50 50, you have more chance, more than me. No, me just turn across the bush. Just understand, you know. Yeah, I'm going to have to pick spot to walk. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is this, this part? It's how I go on. You see that big heap of dirt out this one, Mario? A sun. Sun? I tracked that heap up last night, you know? 
On the OMB, if you could say. Yeah, I'm on the one. Yeah. God for a long time, we don't make one video together, I know one. I'm true, you talk, brother, honestly. Yes, you mean? Honestly, brother, honestly. Slow down, run, and so. I will buy a cup and I ride. Alright? Yeah. No, we are the building then. then. So I, we are thinking about where I go over there. By 1877, when the plantation was surveyed by Thomas it, Harrison, it? it had over 500 acres in Cain. And in 1880, output had reached 710 ox sheds of sugar and 480 punchons of rum. King Albion, the leading producer in Jamaica. This increase in output was mainly attributed to improve the technology in the production process, with the addition of a steam mill to the existing water mill and the adoption of the vacuum pan evaporation method with centrifugal drying from the 1870s. Although John Gladstone had used this method from 1832 in British Guinea, only Albion was using it in Jamaica, resulting in the crystal sugar produced using the method coming to be known in Jamaica as Albion sugar. Come here, could I put a piece of stone? Yeah. Yeah, could I put a piece of, piece of stone? The type of sugar cane under cultivation and the plantation became known as Albion cane. A piece of concrete that took Yo. You get plum? Go lip? Yeah. Go lip you get? Oh Come in In the 1890s, Albion was using the expensive but effective triple effect evaporation method as shown in a contemporary photograph on screen Can I reach out this, Godfrey? But by the early 20th century, its sugarcane was unable to compete with the cheaper European beet sugar and the plantation produced its last crop of sugar in 1928. It was taken over by the United Food Company and planted with bananas and later subdivided into small plots for local farmers. Yeah guys, so we are starting to see relics of the construction. We are starting to see evidence of construction right here. And if you look further up, there is another piece of wall up there. Plus where Godfrey is standing, that look like an arched entrance up there, yeah? In the meanwhile going up there though, I'm going to be giving you guys some information about this site, alright? Just some main information so I can put in context, context what this place was all about. Alright, you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I would have to confirm that uh, still. Like so, you know? Yeah, man. But remember, I know it was more of a workhouse so them used to do the sugar plantation in there, is it? So oh, it got yeah. a lot of different compartments. Yeah. So, what may I go do? Guys, I'm going to show you all a picture of how this place used to be on screen. And in the meanwhile, I'm going to be giving you some information about this place as we try to get around it. 
Now, Albion was a sugar plantation back then. The parish was St. David. All right, now it's St. Thomas. Yeah, and uh, Albion was created sometime in the 1700s because the earliest information I'm finding is the date that the last owner died. And the date that the last owner died is actually 1774. So it would have to it would have to be built before that. Yeah. So what they did they uh, they did uh, sugar and uh, for the most of the time that the plantation was here they were actually doing sugar refining. They had 451 slaves. But then the market began to have a like a more demand for the European beet sugar. So that actually run them out of business at the time. So after they were run out of business, they started doing cattle and stuff like that for Kobe. They used to raise animal and stuff like that. After they finished with that, when that wasn't working out, they started to do banana cultivation for the Jamaica Jamaica Citrus Growers Association or something like that. I'm gonna put the right name on screen guys. I'm not remembering the correct name or the correct term. But anyway, that's a little bit of information for now. And guys, may I tell you say one big piece of building there over there saying so one little piece of the guys. So over there we are gonna know. Alright. Yeah, we're getting up there guys. Alright? Yeah man. Yeah guys, so I have just, like, I think I identified the aqueduct. Now up here I had an aqueduct which was fed from the Yalas River, which ran to Cowbay, which they had their own water mill facilities down there. Maybe one day we can go down there. Well, let me show you a piece of the aqueduct. Aqueduct over here. Yeah, that's the top of the aqueduct over there. Come closer. Get it good. Yeah, get it good. That's a piece of the aqueduct over there, guys. Yeah? And then, I'm not sure if it's the same aqueduct or if it's, this is just a wall. If we're there in a courtyard, but wanna look there. I'm big duck and nest. But anyway, it's all construction all around. We still not really get the perimeter yet. So, what me and God, Godfrey? No. Are you know the perimeter, you know? So, we are try. Okay, guys, we are trying to permit up this place so we can yeah, know where the entrance is, where the house is, where everything is. Because let me tell you what they had over here. I'm going to tell you guys what they had over here, all right? Over here, they had a manager's house and a bookkeeper's quarters, a mill house, trash house, a boiling house, a curing house, distillery, blacksmiths and a carpenter's shop, hospital, accom hospital for accommodation of 20 patients, 21 cottages for coolies, and a sugar estate all right plus the sugar store you know where they store the sugar and stuff like that all right guys me get a better look at a part of the aqueduct i'm show you that take a look at this guys that's a better look at our next part of the aqueduct around here and this is rather huge yeah i think this is our first find or first major find in Yalas and this is Elise Jamaica first vlog after 10 months guys if you all enjoying this let me know click the like button subscribe to the channel and let me know if you see the like button and the subscribe button light up whenever time you press it because the like and subscribe button is supposed to glow with uh, you know something look like the color wheel that color let me know if it lights up whenever time you click those buttons. Anyway, we still have to try to find a way around 
the structures the that are here. Are building, yeah. The aqueduct alone we are seeing. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, the building. Water, the water thing over there, so one of the water weed layers so because of two of them over here. Mm -hmm. me? So one of them that are down there. So. As uh, may I put them up on screen guys so you get a better understanding, can get into context okay. what I'm referring to. Hold on the God for me, I'll go over there to so go get some. Hold on. So guys, I wanna give you guys a better view. Yeah? chance to get over that side because there should be a water wheel over there and I see this a be a mucker there no man alright guys so we just do some research as to the perimeter of the whole property and things like that we get them up and all of that we see the buildings that are supposed to be here but then we find out something else just now that in, um, in 1915, when Frank Kundal wrote the historic, you know, Frank Kundal is a writer that wrote about all these plantations in Jamaica and providers, so the pigs and all of that. But in 1915, when he was writing about this plantation, the only thing that survived was a water wheel and an aqueduct. And this is the aqueduct that survived. So, uh -huh. therefore, the little part of so Godfrey, yeah. don't destroy me a point, Mario. Yeah. In the last two holes, yeah. in this should have been where the water water wheel would have The water run off of the aqueduct, run yeah. down from the water wheel and generate energy right yeah, in this. In so, we have to get in the summary, you understand? Yeah. All right, so guys, I was trying to find information as to where the great house would have been because we find construction over here, so behind the right, there's a Mario. Look, some, 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 some little wall and thing over here, so and yeah, one high piece of concrete. Yeah. But with all of that, I wasn't, I wasn't finding any information or any information on this part to say that this would have been the great house. It's not compartmented like a compartmentalized or it not split up like one great house. Uh, if it looked more like this would have been where you know the water, the water distill, distill with the water mill is over there. So this would have been where they put the sugar. That is sugar curing house, one of the cure houses. I'm not sure if it's a sugar curing house, but this will be one of the cure houses. So in 1915, the great house was already in ruins, gone. Yeah, yeah. Mr. So. Yeah. That's so where the plantation is named that time. Albion Estate. Albion Estate, mm -hmm. same way. Yeah. And the great house, the great house is known as Albion Castle. Yeah. yeah guys, may I go from a phone because it's been a while since when I know so a while we done this and if I, may I forget back used to keeping everything in my head so I have my notes them where may I work from because you know me have to research the plantation before. You understand? Uh -huh. So we are trying to reach over this area. Which way? Oh we're going on a we're going on the house now. Follow me my guys. Look out for what's in the 
Hai, încă și eu am doar câteva chestii, încă So guys, as I was saying, um, I really feel like the water we need to get in because this is the aqueduct up here. The aqueduct up here, guys. So right now, I'm going to start check out. In here, sir. I see what I'm Yeah. What for? Wait, the nail from the other end. Yeah, guys. So as you notice, this is where the water wheel would have been but yeah it's gone sold for scrap metal and just like these pictures that you're gonna be seeing on screen now i think these were sold for scrap metal also yeah man i'm showing you some picture with how the inside of the distillery is there now there are steps going down most likely to service the water wheel you know when the water come down off of the aqueduct up there guys the water come down off the aqueduct Hit the water wheel, which would have been inside here before they removed it. Those sides on the wall right there, that's where the bearings would have been to hold the water wheel. So when the water wheel, when the water run down off the water wheel, it goes through that small hole right there. Alright, so the more water going through that small hole, the more pressure. And then the water wheel turning creates energy. So if they had, if they use the energy for electricity, you know them have all the electricity. Sometimes they use it for like grind grains and all of that. It was a sugar mill, so maybe they use it to grind the cane. You understand what I'm saying, Godfrey? Yeah. yeah I'm sure. I'm sure. The same thing I could have put on, no, Godfrey? Mm, the one in a good condition. Yeah. That's the, the gutter with the water, the pressure. Like the more, the more water goes down in there, yeah. the more pressure you get, isn't it? Yeah. I do 1.5 picture here so see we can get it smaller. Yeah man, we're not all right, man. It's a good look, Alex. It's good. Yes, definitely. It's not fast. No else but yeah, so. It come and stop. It must go somewhere. Throw the wall design there so to feed, Alex. Mario, only something see me can go down there. Up on the top. Yeah, and then big legs size. So I'm going to place the round there so we can walk and go in. Secret stone, like in a Indiana Jones. Yeah. You know, in a Indiana Jones, people, when you press the secret stone, everything just came. Yeah. Oh. The design of people look for the design. Yeah, so the design. That's the water wheel would have been here. As we tell us, look up here, sir. Yeah. The water run on the aqueduct from there, come down. Water run on the aqueduct from there, come down here. Yeah, then it runs off down inside here. Hit the water wheel and flows through the culvert or I'm gonna call it a pipe, but it's built out of concrete. It flows through that. I'm gonna show them how that but the motor for the the motor for the water wheel, the motor most likely would have been in a room over there or somewhere underground where one of those holes on the side lead. But as I try to go down there a while ago, the wall them look like the mouth for cave in still. As you notice, I show no. You notice that I crack the wall I crack right down there, so I'm not done. Alright, so yeah, because when the first one I died, it was 1774, so I'm not sure how long it was here, but it was here a rather long time. I remember you first time at the 1600 when them right about it. You see me? No, 1915 that man, when Kundal right about it, that different. Yeah. So I try to show you from, from 1915, no great house no there. I just the aqueduct and the water wheel there. 
So would a search in vain for a great house. Yeah. You understand? One will find like foundation structures are like the, 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 the manager's office and them little thing there, is it? So guys, yeah, we I will check out the side here and see our next little part where it look like there would have been it couldn't have been two water wheel same place. I've never seen that before. I don't know if they would have need to do that. But I'm going to look. Yeah, two over here, but they wouldn't have the same aqueduct so close in a such close proximity. You see the water will run go down there, so they would have to get it back from the aqueduct to make it flow up on the next water wheel because the water will come down to go up on the water wheel to spin it. That's why the water wheel is thin, isn't it? Alright, so, guys, we don't want to see what power we are trying to go over there, so. I'm so excited to be back on the road doing all these videos. Thank you all for being here to wait out the waiting period. Although I'm going one and two videos still, but I know y'all miss these types of videos. And trust me, I just them kind of videos I'm going to try to focus on right now. I'm back out on the road. After all of this, we talk about the year cut and everything. We're not talking about that now. We're the history now. Let's get back to class. Remember to like and subscribe, guys. Help the channel. We're heading to 150 by two months time. Help you do that. Please, don't you think we deserve it? Yeah man, that's what I said. Yeah, exactly. It's a farmer, a piece of paper in the desert. Oh, you know what? You see the water wheel motor? The water wheel motor over there, sir. Yeah. Guys, so you see, when I was saying that no, that the hole down at the bottom, where the, it would have to have a room for the motor of the water wheel. I put one picture on screen, guys, let you see what the water wheel motor look like. But this is the room in which they would have kept it because it's kind of big enough. So that would be where the generator would have been, so to speak. But it's a motor, you know, every, 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 every up to this day, um, water wheels use motors. All right? So it's like a generator to generate energy. So this is inside of where it would have been. God, do you think it's safe here? There's some debris All right, guys, look at the over here. Yeah. Well, it would have been your biggest video. Godfrey, hmm? if this is Japan week, that'd be your biggest video, you know? Not sure why. Yeah. Get them published here. Round us, sir? No, my Romario would have published them. Yeah, you see, up there, so guys, look like it would be a water mill. Couldn't be a water wheel, but may I try to reach up there still. Wow, reach up them. I feel like we do some real deep dive through some deep bush today. Wow, no, sir. Type deep dive on the screen from the wall, so we do that. Alright? Yeah, man. So, I could see if we can do this. Mario, camera. Hmm? Marco, you sure? Yeah, yeah. That's why I'm not picked up. That's why I'm not picked up there. That's why I'm not picked up there. One day I'll come like me and step in the blue. No, Guys, we are trying to do this for today. We have to reach over this one. Go to the long way around. Alright. Sometimes when we look for all of them here, right? The amount of these constructions that we have found, these historic sites, some of them not even much deteriorated as this. Why the government keep on send people away from farm work? Why them allow the program if it's still go on? When them could have used these same plantations, obviously nobody not own them because it's under the heritage society. Why them can't use these plantations which 
most likely would have been fertile grounds from back then because them people back then don't farm on land unless it's fertile why them not use lands like these and get farm workers to actually do things where produce farming for Jamaica, produce stuff for Jamaica, ground produce, apples, strawberry, whatever it is that they can plant and that would have really helped the country, that would have helped the economy you know, instead of sending people away and them are working like nothing, come like a slave with them are going these places can be utilized for that purpose, I don't know maybe, maybe, maybe I'm not smart enough, I'm just a YouTuber still so, you know Yeah guys, so we have to reach over there, so the mark of them bad doing over there. Yeah man, I'm sure I'm going to go. Yeah man, I'm sure I'm going to go. Remember, we have to come back out, you know? No, God, it looks like that one here. I want to block up, you know, God, friend? I want to block up, you know? Yeah, I'm going to block up, you know? No. The shoes now nah, the money over here, sir. Only for some long over here, sir. Nah, sir, bro, bro. So, just come on. Come on, 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 What up, Maka? As I know, guys, Godfrey have a. I don't know what to tell them, say. Godfrey have a foot who are in trouble. An injury. Where something stick him in his ankle. And now it's a game problem. So he can't move as fast as he would want to move. And you know, we have to snake them over here. We don't want them going on slippers, you know. Mario, come here. I call that, no? I call that, no? No, I'm going to call that. What that brought up this thing? I don't. Take 
Check time. Was. Alright, today, today, me like today. Today is a great issue walk for real, that we don't. Cut cross. Hmm? What's by my one? What's wrong there? You know where I walk through what's though? Guys, so I get a one, a little one sting. I don't want no more. Somebody cut down your sword here. Yeah, can't go your sword off, bro. God, for somebody cut down your sword. Yeah. And store the mock of them. Yeah. I don't want to cross this, you know. Yeah, I don't want to reach. Guys, you know what I'm saying? Alright, okay, so the aqueduct actually became level with the ground. So I wanted to go up there and see if it went underground where there would be any tunnels underground. Go could I try to explore. Anyway, may I try to reach up there still? Nico, you can follow me? Yeah, you yeah. sure? Keep on a call you Nico. Alright, you see them here? Yeah. What kind of Mario? So don't step too heavy upon them here? Godfrey, boy, you good? Smarty that. Come tell me if I smarty that, Mario. Yeah, guys. So the aqueduct became. Level Man, I passed through, you know The aqueduct became level With The ground, once again Somebody over there A cool, a stick there, you look bad So This Here guys Would have been Because guys see with it on top of the aqueduct right now. Come show them the aqueduct. This is the aqueduct right here guys. For those who are not familiar with what an aqueduct is, well the water actually run in the middle of this. It's like a gutter that was built back then using stones. Alright, them never, I mean, I think they would have the equipment where we have nowadays to make a way with pipes and all of that. And this was rather efficient. It worked. See that, people? Look up here. A woman had that stuck in her foot, you know? Look here. You see how they're shop? Them we walk through from morning. Yeah, so this was the aqueduct, guys. As you see, it is now level with the ground. Just to show you the height where we cover, because I'm going to show you back a picture of the aqueduct, how high it was, and where we are now. We're actually standing on the aqueduct. 
Well, I'm going to take out some of my shoes too. Watch out. You see much in there? Should I mark that in Yeah. So I'm going to test it. Can I move right now, man? Look here. Go down there. Yeah, man. That's the most important part, right? Guys, you know what's that? Watch out. Mark that in peeps. All the money. They are in that shit in your shoes, dude. Huh? They are shit in your shoes. Mm -hmm. Hey guys. Yeah, the right, sir. Yeah, so oh, so much for my shoes too. Mhm. Mm oh. This would be like a tank. Oh. Mhm. Mm Mark them, Godfrey. Oh, man, they're terrible. Sorry, them soldier. Now I've broke them down for now. It's on a feed. So that my people way up on the surface of the land. Yeah, I lent to them that. Yeah. And that the shot that broke. I want to tell them so they want the little bit. Look a bit. That broke. <laughs> yeah. So they are called up, gone up on the ground and say, I know the yeah. some part of it gone back some over. Some little tunnel, stuff. tunnel over this because they want to do maintenance. Mm. Maintenance for you. Ja, ja. Clean it. We need to clean. Try again, guys. Don't know. But we don't know. That long, you know what? You walk on them, everyone. Does them on there? Does them on there? You're not getting on Godfrey? The one when we did have on, Jesus Christ, more than a dead. You know, and I would have some of them that would have laughed in a laugh. You know what I mean? You see it, brother? So, 
Let me know what me I say. Mm -hmm. Can't wait for that one there. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. yeah peeps, so uh, I spot one cold skin. I don't know, who for one still? Don't want to get no trouble, but I have to show you this guys. For those of you do, who do not know how charcoal is made in Jamaica, well, this is one of the process. This is the first process where they pile the wood. They pile up the wood. This is before it is lit. Then I light it, and it stayed about like, about, about a week, Godfrey. Yeah. About a week of cold skin to burn. Yeah, yeah guys, it stay for about a week. And yeah, it stays for about a week, and then after that, depending on the size, yeah. Are you able? Then after that, you have charcoal, yeah. So, this is the first phase of a coal skill, guys. Check that out. Yeah, peeps, so this is how it looks when it is just packed. When it's not actually lit as yet. As I tell them, I don't know how for one. You now I get in trouble, so I'm not even going to go close to it. I'm just going to show you guys around. Yeah? So that's a cold skin. And it looks like we have a use of that over here. Through there. So Godfrey now has to go through the marker with him foot. Yeah? Got for one pass there, sir. Have a night? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, guys. Find one truck where you can put it deep out of the front. Yeah? yeah? We have one next. When we look on the map, there's another piece of construction that should be somewhere around. We'll try to find it. The next video will be the Kunu Kunu Park. It's one of the greatest hiking trails in Jamaica. And guess what? Today in St. Thomas. We're actually going to be hiking from St. Thomas to Portland across the hills. We can't see the hill level here, so still. I suppose them hills over there. So don't that bring Mountains over there. We're going to be hiking across those mountains from St. Thomas into Portland. That's the next vlog for you guys. Subscribe to the channel so you miss the one there. Alright? And every comment count. Leave your feedback if you know of sites that you want us to visit. You let me know. Alright? Yes, man. Little piece of building down there, sir. Godfrey, I saw you walk when you are walking. Guys, another piece of construction right here. Yeah, man. Not sure what to here. Like one of the outhouse them like the manager's office or the sugar house or you know them little outhouse battery. As I told you guys, whenever time we find places like these, there is always some outer houses like uh, you know slave quarters, workers quarters, managers quarters, production house, mill. I'm a good clean piece of building around the town we are passing up on the left hand side over there. Mm -hmm. And that's still an around uh, the, the, the backyard. The yeah, yeah. and around the backyard where I tell you about. Because the great house is the most amazing piece of building. Yeah, guys, there's some more construction here. That freak. Yeah. How fast are you now? You realize all the ground, see you look on the ground. Yeah. Do they? A cow walk at them places, you know? I'm going to something down the cow today, Alright, so guys, here's another piece of construction right here. Not sure what this was either, but this have a square. The end of it square, as you understand, the, the, the end of the building. So 
can see that was another outfield. And then we have more around here. And a man caught too, you know. Smell him, you know. Yeah. Him there, man. That's another piece of building up there, guys. Yeah. You catch a um, Mario? A red cow up here and I'm in one spot him one at the time in you know, yeah. Just hope I don't see him again because I don't know that. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, true. Yo, you see them lock off on the tool when they can't give me a problem. I'm going to stand up there now wait for the tool assistance. So. Guys, you see when I look across the bush? In the bush, one bag of cow. May I show you one clip? Can we take a little clip? When you look from that, yeah, guys, this at the entrance of one building. And look here, guys, when you know me, I see one column, two column, and there is nothing can stop me from going over this right now. Go see how it is over there because that makes sense to me. The front of a building. So, the, so the, this would be the entrance, yes, sir. We see an entrance. Oh, up there, so they're going to come in. Yeah, guys, I don't know more seafood. This is the front of a building. So follow me Mario. Let me see something. I don't know what I like. You know what I said before my talk. Because Frank Kundal said that the Great House was demolished before 1915. However, this could have been the Great House and when he said demolished, this could have been what it looked like. Because from 1915 till now, no real no holy part time, you know, because my grandfather born 1913. You know, and he just died recently. Huh? My next part, though. Go on. Yeah, guys, so 1915 wouldn't be any long time before now. So this could have been what he had seen. Godfrey, you know, so this could have been why I did say and said the great house demolish. This could have been the great house now because it looks like I'm saying demolish. Because it built, it, it would have the structure, the construction model of what would have been a great house. This one is compartmentalized. Yeah. Guys, this is the great house. Not 100% sure, but this looks like the great house, yeah? Because there's no other building on the plantation which they would have built like this. Unless it's a storage house, but... Um, yeah, as soon as me edit me put information about that that on screen or in a voiceover, a short voiceover guys, alright? Yeah man. Up there someone. So this was definitely a large building, but I'm not sure what it was if this was the great house because as from the documents, they said it wasn't here. Uh, in 1915 it has been demolished already. This demolished, so it could have been this he was referring to. Yeah, because him say um the great house, the great house, the aqueduct and the water wheel, but the great house was already demolished in 1915. So that sounds to me like him depend on one spot as the three item them. I'm going to tell you, well, them two they're the same, but that one they demolished. Yeah. Most likely 1950 when he wrote that, the water wheel, the wheel itself would have still been in where it's supposed to be. Okay. Because they never used to sell scrap metal them time. You see me? So this could have been the great house. Yeah. We're not sure. We can't really go ahead and say, yeah, and verify it until we get further information. Other building, Other building over the building over the All right. So we can't go back to yeah, because as guys, I gave you guys a list of all the buildings that are here 
So I hold up a construction over here. But as you know, as the years go by, the less we are going to see. Let's move on and see if we can find the next half a building around the road. People, I'm gonna fill my pocket. We should bring my pocket. Bring on here. Don't let's pick your shirt. I bring one bug. People, you know me, I'm still full. <laughs> Don't know what I think, them people, I'm in Africa. You yeah, know what I mean, I'm still full, I just die. Guys, you know me, I eat mango, but I love fruits. You see me? Yeah. You notice me, I just eat as as many as I can eat. Just can't eat them. I don't eat, man. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. Well, people more for let you out of the yard than in the yard, you know. So I come, we are coming out to the house. Let me out. Alright. You know what I'm doing? No? So, so get some of you to the house. Mm-hmm. Find you to go for a walk. You must see, you, you, you don't care come out there. Hmm? Donkey, 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 don't care come. Donkey? Where? Where are you going to go? Yo, what are you doing now? Are you going to ask me to run off of you? Yeah. Can you say them dangerous animals there, come? Yeah, some of them are more than a play, no one's in the way, you know. Share, comment, subscribe, you know, as I said, to Elite Official Jamaica, Elite Jamaica Official Channel, yeah, and God for us burn it out here, so that is it, you know, some of my Elite can really spare the things that we're just where we are going to show you. No, you know, I'm going to show them. I'm going to come back I'm going to come back up. I'm going to come to come back I'm going to come back up. I'm going to come back up. I'm going to come to come to come back up. I'm going 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 to come back up. i Okay. That's the yard, that's the yard. That's the yard, that's the yard. That's the yard, that's
forget to drop a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe.